today. So today, we have started our glossy box openings again. So I'm gonna apologize about the lighting a little bit because it seems to be a little bit here and there. In fact, let me see whether I can alter it, just bear with me. I feel like this is a little bit more natural. I don't know. Anyway, we are gonna open up our glossy box. I think it's because it's reflecting off that that it's coming off me. I apologise. It's getting dark like super early. So I've been up since five o'clock today. Well, quarter to five actually. So I'm looking a little bit worse for wear. So you will have to bear with me. But we are going to open our glossy box. So this came... When did it come? Um, three, three days ago? Um, and I've resisted opening it. So we're, we're going to open it now. So the box, I'm going to start off by showing you the box, it's tin, which I love, um, and that's the front, and then that is the back, and I just think it's a really cute box. My only issue is that mine's got a dent in it, I don't know if you can see. So I'm a little bit upset, but we, we move, we move, we can, we can, we can deal. So let's open it up. Oh, it says wonders on the inside, I think. Is it wonders? Yeah, wonders. That is a very cute box. I love that. Pop this down here. Um, and this says scan me. So I I haven't had a glossy box in a while, so I'm assuming all the info is on here rather than in a leaflet but I'm not 100% sure let's unwrap this and see what we got now I do know one of the items um, in the box because it was on their Instagram and I was like ah oh. but then I know that some of them are random items so we'll, we'll have a look and we'll see so the paper is just uh, grey which is super nice Look at the paper! This is what's in. It looks like it's a really full box actually. Let me scan that um that QR code and we'll see what what's what. Oh, that's super cute. So you get it all on your device now and you can flip through. It's like a magazine. Um I actually really like that. Okay, let me I'm not gonna go too much into like the nitty gritty we're just gonna you know so let's pick this one first so this is the it's a number seven product looks a bit like a highlighter let me have a look so illuminating pressed highlighting gold powder and it's called golden glue so let me have a look ah so it says you'll receive one of these two so one is the number seven that we got and then the other one is by the beauty crop I've never actually heard of them before this retails at 13 pound and 95p let's give it a swatch I love a golden uh, highlighter so this is the powder open block my face see if it makes a difference and then I am gonna swatch it okay so it is it's a very iridescent highlighter. I don't know whether, let me pop it a little bit to the light, if you can see. It's very pretty, it's very subtle. Um, it would probably go with my face at the moment because I've hardly got any makeup on. Let me, let me powder my face, bear with. So I powdered my face a little bit. I'm gonna actually just go in with a bit of this on a big brush and let's, Oh, that's cute. I like that. It's quite subtle, but I really like it. I feel like I've overloaded on the highlighter now, but I really like that. That's super cute. So I knew what this second item was going to be, and it actually kind of made me want the box um, and start up again. So, and I, they're so cute. These are so cute. These are mini pixie glow tonics. Look how freaking cute they are! Not got that one facing the front, there we go. So these retail at £5 each. Insane. However, what I will say, I'm nearly out. 
So I'm quite thankful. Um, and I think in the new year, I'm gonna buy myself a big bottle of it. When I tell you that that, along with other products and good skincare, has like sorted my skin out. Like, I have hardly got any makeup on today. I've got the tiniest bit of foundation mixed in with like a, a glowy luminator. Um, and it's just, and obviously I've got the highlighter on my eyes. Um, I've put on a tiny bit of concealer under my eyes, but my skin, I'll zoom you in, my skin is just looking so much healthier these days. Um, and I do think it is a little bit down to this, so over the moon with these. Perfect for traveling as well. So the next thing is a Josephine item. And we have had Josephine items before. Um, we had a red lipstick, which is actually one of my favorite lipsticks, um, like red lipsticks of, of all time. In fact, you'll probably see that in a video coming up. Um, this is a highlighter. Oh, I've like overdone it with the highlighter. This is a highlighter, I think. This is called Do You. Yeah, liquid highlighter. Let's let's swatch. Oh, the dofer looks like a lip dofer. You can see on there. Swatch it. Oh, whoa! Look at that shine. How does it blend out? Oh, it's very thick. Would it be over the top to put some on my... Do you know what? We'll do it. We'll go for it. I feel like I need to dip a little bit more in. Oh, I love this. Mmm. I really like it. I would probably use my finger to actually get it off and pop it on rather than the applicator oh yes that is a win for me let me just check up some info on it okay so it's it's not in the catalog but i've looked it up online like it's not in the catalog at all um but it's it's retailing at 36 dollars on the, the Josephine website. <laughs> Am I supposed to have this? I mean, I love it, so thank you. I mean, that's, I'm very happy with it. How weird. Okay, so the next thing is a Philip Kingsley um, Elastic Booster, and this is a restoring conditioner. Which, I love a good conditioner. Um, and I've had quite a lot of Philip Kingsley stuff before. And this is a deluxe mini size. Um, there's not much to say on it. It's a decent uh, hair conditioner. I have had some before. Um, and it's always good to have the minis for when you go on holiday. So I'm very happy about that. Okay, so this is called the Give Them La La Beauty Lip Duo Lip Liner and Lipstick. <laughs> so this is a double one. Um, let me open this up. What colour of Oh my god, look at those components! Let me cover my face up. Oh, that is a really like sturdy and substantial. Like it's plastic, which but I really like the component. Um and the lip pencil is just standard called the beach is this oh they're both called the beach Let me, and they're both a nude that is a very orangey nude um i'm gonna assume that the um lip liner is the same eh, it looks quite similar shall we try it on so usually if i was to get a, a lip liner I usually use a darker colour than the colour itself, but for for testing, we'll try it. So now the lip liner's on, it actually looks more like a, a peachy colour. But this is this is more of a nude. Mmm, so they're not the same colour. Mm, I don't know whether I like that co combo. 
That is a very pale nude. Very pale. I'll zoom you in so you can see. That is a very pale nude. I don't know whether I would wear that if I had a darker lip liner with it. I don't think that lip liner goes with it, even though they're the same colour. But I, I really like the colour of this lipstick. So my curiosity got the best of me and I actually put on a dark lip liner with that lipstick and I think this looks so much better. Um, I'm not a fan of that lip, like the, the formula of this lip liner is beautiful. The colour, not so much. So I'd be interested to see, I'm just, I'm curious to understand why they put these two together. Um, let me quickly see what it says about this. So this actually retails at £22, which um, for a high-end lip liner stick duo is, is about average. Would I pay that for this? I mean, I'd be very disappointed if I got that lip liner and I'd paid all that money for it. But the lipstick's a really nice consistency. It doesn't... It's nice and creamy and the lip line is very creamy so if you got the right colour for yourself but I would definitely wear this lipstick because I think it looks really nice. Then last but not least, let me have a look. This is Mon Monu Skin and it's Rosewood Reviving Mist. Uh, let me have a look and see what it says. So this is a deluxe mini and it's worth £9.95p. Um, and it's a beauty bag essential for providing your skin with a quick pick-me-up infused with lemon, rose water and sandalwood like they're like some of my favourite scents so I should like this um, and it's good for refreshing your makeup so let's, I've had this makeup on all day so except from the highlighter, I feel like I've got an overload of highlighter my friend Oh, that smell is so nice. Oh, do you know what? I actually quite like that for a little pick-me-up. Yeah, quite impressed. I, I'd, I'd use that quite a bit, actually. So there you go, guys. That is my glossy box this month. I am super happy. This is one of the best glossy boxes I feel like I've had. Um, so I'm really glad that I started up. I think for the £10 that you pay for it I think this is like insane value and there's not apart from the lip liner which I wasn't happy with the colour but I probably will use it at some point like everything is stuff that I would use in this box so I, I'm super happy but I just think this is super good value this month and I'm actually really looking forward to next month, so fingers crossed. So guys, thank you so much for joining me today. Again, I really, really appreciate you watching my videos. Uh, that was a nice little exciting one. My next video will be me going through the empties that I've gone through over the last month or so. So uh, don't forget to look out for that. But again, as always, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you do like what you've seen on my channel. And any feedback at all or any ideas for videos, please pop them down below in the comments and I will always reply and I always take on your feedback as well. I hope you have a wonderful day guys and love you.